right, today I'm going to film part two, two of my um, trying American foods thing. And so I've got a bag full of stuff that I've never tried. Um, I think all, yeah, all of this I've never tried before, um, apart from the first thing, which is Amazon and Fruit Punch. And I'm like 98% certain that I've had this before. So I'm just going to open this now and try it. Make sure, <laughs> make sure it's what I think it is. And then I can just use this to have in between all of my American snacks. Yeah, I've had this before. Mm -hmm. It's like orange juice, but with other stuff in there. Um, I have Snapple Dew, and I've had Snapple's like, I think theirs is called something along the lines of Fruit Punch. I've had that before, and I really like that too. So, this is good. Mm. In this video, I'm going to be rating things out of 10. So I shall give this drink a 9 out of 10, because it's really good. But not the best thing I've ever drunk. So now I'm out of time. I'm gonna keep this next day. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna try is ooh, Swedish fish. What are Swedish fish? I have no idea. Let's have a look. Oh my god! Oh, got it. Oh, they smell funny. Oh. Mm. Okay. So a little fish. I don't think I'm keen on this. They're like, oh. They're like cherry, um, gummy things. They've got like a weird other thing in that. I'm not like, you know, they're not awful. Um, I think they're like a five. Like, I can eat them, but they're nothing special. Okay. Next thing I'm gonna try is I'm looking, but I'm trying to like, pick randomly. Mm. A Reese's fast break. Now, I've never tried anything Reese's based purely on the fact that I don't like peanuts. So I've never tried peanut butter. So I've never wanted to try Reese's. But I thought I would give it a go. I've never tried it, so you know I could love it. But oh, it smells very peanutty. Why am I doing this? I might just snap a bit off and I can give it to someone else if I don't like it. If I chew it, people probably won't mind me yet. It's like this. It's like peanut butter, nougat, or nugget, whatever you want to call it, and chocolate. Oh, okay. I don't know what I think. Sorry, peanut you. When I'm not hating it, it's not the worst thing I've ever eaten. I'm just not a massive, massive fan of peanuts. I'm going to give it a four. Because I reckon if I carried on eating it, I'd probably like it. <laughs> the next thing that I'm going to try is Jolly Ranchers Hard Candy. I think I've had like Jolly Ranchers Soft Candy before. I don't know why I have it in my head that I've had this before. I might not have. But I, I have a feeling that I might have. Can't open it. Oops, got it. Okay, so. Oh. There are apparently five flavors. So there's cherry, apple, blue, blue raspberry, um, grape. Watermelon. Oh, watermelon can be on the same colour as red. Oh, there it is, watermelon. So I'm gonna get, I've got one of each out of the packet. Okay, so I'm gonna try. No, no, no. Let's try apple first, because I like apple flavour sweet. Green's okay if it's apple, I don't like lime. Because they're quite soft, they probably not a bit. It's sticking to my teeth. It's really nice, it's very apple y. Um, we used to have something over here called them. Um, oh, oh, I can't remember what they were called. They were like apple things, and they're supposed to make your mouth water, like to make you feel like you were having a drink. 
it was worth it. But yeah, that's kind of what they taste like. Okay, great. Oh my god. I think it's the grateful one. The apple is like a, a, a solid seven. The grape is a one. Oh my god. Oh. That does not taste like grapes. It's blue raspberry. Uh, I would say the blue raspberry tastes more like grapes than grape does. Yeah, I'm playing, but this, this tastes like grape. But I like it, it's nice. Um, a six, it's not as nice as the apple. Okay, cherry. They obviously melted at some point because they're like sticking to my teeth. And what's that's super normal? Like, do they normally stick to your teeth? Is that a normal thing? Please let me know. Okay, cherry. Oh my god. I can't open that. Help me. Okay. Cherry. That tastes like a cherry drop. It's good. Um, seven. Like the grape. No, like the apple. Definitely not the grape. Okay, last one. Watermelon. That's uh, definitely watermelon. I'm not the world's mass biggest fan. Massivist? I'm not the world's biggest fan of watermelon, but um, it tastes like watermelon. If you like watermelon, then you'll like that too. So. I give that a seven. Cheetos Crunchy. Now I've had um, the Cheetos Puffs from America before and I really like those. So these are I think, definitely like crunchy versions. They look like um, knickknacks, which we have in the UK. Yeah. They taste like crunchy Cheetos. Oh, they're not that crunchy. I get like one good crunch. Mm, no, I like this. I like cheetos, so I was gonna like these. Eight. Eight out of ten. Next thing I have is like an ice. Um, either cherry, lemon, strawberry, lime, and orange. Now with real fruit juice. We didn't have this before. I'm gonna more like English sweets than a friend of fruit juice. Oh, they look like cool. They do not look like what I thought they would look like. I thought they would be like, in my head I imagine like licorice torpedoes, like if you have those. I imagine them looking like that. These are just like jelly babies. Not jelly babies, jelly beans. Yeah, they're jelly beans. That one is a uh, cherry, I think. Very fake cherry though. Not nice fake cherry. Um, oh, that's lime, I hate lime. No. Orange? I'll give them a six. Next thing I'm gonna try is a take five bar. Now I think this is um, Hershey. Yeah, it's made by Hershey. Um, it is chocolate pretzels, peanut butter, caramel, and peanuts. Now this is two, three out, two out of the five things in this are peanut based. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna like it. I'm probably not. But I will give it a go in the name of YouTube. Oh, it smells, oh, it smells so peanutty. That was actually okay. The thing you can taste most in that is the pretzel. And I love pretzel and chocolate. Like the peanut is only very like slightly there. It's more of an aftertaste of peanut and anything else. Yeah, I can't taste the caramel. I can taste the chocolate and the pretzel and a bit of the peanut. That's it. But it's good. Mm, that's okay. Um, I think I can see the peanut thing. Okay. Um, I give that one a five. I could eat that. And then I'm gonna try cinnamon toast crunch. I'm not gonna put any milk on it because that would require me going downstairs. So I'm just gonna try a little piece of cinnamon toast crunch. Mm. Oh my gosh, yum. I wonder if we get some um, milk now. I need these. 
I love cinnamon. This is awesome. Um, ten, ten. I've never, I've never had a cereal like that before. Oh, that's so nice. Yum. The next thing that I'm going to try is an Oreo brownie. I like brownie. I like Oreo. So this better not let me down. Look! It looks pretty. It's quite nice. Um, very rich. Like that. Is that much of it? I think I would struggle to go on. I want to give it a seven and a half out of ten because I think I would struggle to eat it. But it's yummy. Icebreaker sours. I've had the green ones with these before. They're the pink ones. I like this. Kind of spotty thing. I like reasonably sour. I look at this. An eight out of ten. The last thing that I have to try is cinnamon roll chewing gum. Oh, it's brown. Unsurprisingly. That is good. That is the cinnamon roll in chewing gum. Oh my god. Well done, Wrigley's. Well done. 10 out of 10. Okay, so that is the end of me trying American foods. Unfortunately, I have no American food left, and now my bed is just covered in packets that have half opened and eaten the sweets. However, I found a couple of new favourites, so when I go over to America this summer, I will be sure to stock up. I'm just going to sit here now with my cinnamon roll chewing gum and my fruit punch and continue my day happy. Thank you for watching my video. If you liked it, please subscribe. If you can think of anything else that I can try that's American, um, then please comment below and let me know. Thank you for watching. Bye.